So my question to you is, looking back at what you said then and what you're saying now, which one should people believe? You denied that you've ever supported legal status for undocumented immigrants. You said, quote, I've never supported legalization. I do not intend to support it. But back in 2013, you did support an amendment. And back when you were making the case, this is what you said. I don't want immigration reform to fail. I want immigration reform to pass. Then we should look for areas of bipartisan agreement and compromise to come together. Now that amendment would have allowed undocumented immigrants to uh, remain in the U.S. permanently and obtain legal status. So how do you square that circle? Uh, actually, Brett, it, it, it wouldn't have. Now the fact that I introduced an amendment to remove part of the Gang of Eight bill doesn't mean I support the rest of the Gang of Eight bill. The Gang of Eight bill was a mess. It was a terrible bill. That is not what you said at the time. And Yahoo dug up these quotes from back then. You said, if this amendment were to pass, the chances of this bill passing into law would increase dramatically. A few weeks later, during a debate on the Senate floor, Cruz repeated his belief that his amend this amendment is the compromise ca that can pass. And you repeated later in Princeton uh, that if my amendment were adopted, this bill would pass. It sounded like you wanted the bill to pass. I want immigration reform to pass. Uh, of course I wanted the bill to pass, what my, my amendment to pass. What my amendment did is take... Uh, of course I wanted the bill to pass, what my, my amendment to pass. What it, what it doesn't mean that I supported the other aspects of the bill, which was a terrible bill. I want immigration reform to pass. The problem, though, is that at the time, you were telling people like Byron York with the Washington Examiner that this was not a poison pill. I want immigration reform to pass. Well, you told him my objective was not to kill immigration reform. You said you wanted it to pass at the time. So my question to you is, looking back at what you said then and what you're saying now, which one should people believe? After five debates, Senator Rubio finally admitted not only was he for the Rubio-Schumer amnesty proposal, but he still supports amnesty today. I want immigration reform to pass. The way you solve the problem is you focus where there's bipartisan agreement first. They will be out of here so freaking fast. Once we've solved that problem, then we can have a debate, then we can have a conversation. We have to end this sanctuary city's crap fast, fast. Then we can have a conversation. Fast.